The original 14 litre V8 with 350 horsepower was a sensation when it came in 1969. Nobody needed that amount of power, but it was fun to drive. The engine established itself as a rugged workhorse that kept running seemingly forever. In 2000, the output had risen to 530 horsepower and the 14 litre was replaced by the 16 litre with up to 580 and 620 for Euro 4 and Euro 5. The new V8 is added to the Euro 5 range and is based on a new platform that permits considerably higher outputs. The new platform is part of our new engine range with a 130mm cylinder bore. The first engines, the 9 and the 13 litre engine, were launched in 2007. The idea was of course to create a modular engine range that could use the, all technologies for the future challenges to come. Some ideas about the technologies needed are for example the Scania VGT, the turbocharger. On this engine <clears throat> it is used to create the enormous power and not to drive EGR. The emission controls concept is SCR like on the other V8 engines. Other new things on this engine is the new uh, silencer with the SCR catalyst, an updated doser, a second NOx sensor for better feedback control, all of which we think are on the way of the technology we need for Euro 6. Key for us is the yellow box in the middle, the Scania ECU. The Scania ECU contains uh, updated software for combustion control and the new controls for after treatment, that is emissions control. The other key technology that we have moved from our 9 and 13 liter engines onto this V8 is the Scania XPI the high pressure common rail system. Here you see it implemented on the V8 engines. Big difference is the two rails supplying the two banks of the V8, an upgraded uh, high pressure pump and a new layout of the low pressure system.